Welcome to another Tech Help video brought to you by AccessLearningZone.com. I'm your instructor, Richard Rost. Today, we're going to talk about a new feature that was added to Microsoft Access. You can now open queries directly in SQL view, either from the navigation pane or in your code or in a macro. Let's talk about it. Shout out to the guys over at Access Forever. It's where I get a lot of my access news from. Here's the link to their article down here. I'll put it down in the description down below. You can just click on it if you want to go read it. They go over all the details down here. Apparently, you can just right click in the navigation pane and go to SQL view. Now, that's a big time saver for me because before you used to have to open it up, go to design view and then in design view, go to SQL view. I like working in SQL view most of the time myself. They also added it to the do command open query where you can now open it in AC view SQL. That's pretty cool. You could put a button on your forms if your form is like tied to a query, for example. Or if you're still using macros, there's a new macro option for it. So there you go. Again, head on over to their website if you want to read the full article. Now, what's that you say? You don't see that option. You come over here, you right click, you don't see SQL view. Well, you might have to update access. Now, I always recommend an Access 365 subscription, but if you've got one of these versions here, it looks like uh, 2016 C2R, 2019, 2021 and of course 365 it should update in any of these versions at least that's what the access forever guys posted but again i recommend a subscription so go get yourself a subscription and once you do you can force an update go to file and then account and then come over here go to update options and do an update now i had to do one this morning because i didn't have it either and then when all that's done access is going to shut down you can restart it and you should be able to go, whoop, let me open it back up again. Come here. <laughs> you should be able to now go right click SQL view. See that? That's pretty cool. And you can still right click here and go back to design view if you like working in here. Okay. You can also put a button on a form and use that VBA code that I showed you a minute ago. Or if you're still using macros, go put it in a macro. That's about it. Real quick one for today, folks. Hope you learned something. That's going to be your tech help video for today. Live long and prosper, my friends. I'll see you next time. If you enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up and post any comments you may have below. I do try to read and answer all of them as soon as I can. Make sure you subscribe to my channel, which is completely free. Click the bell icon and select all to receive notifications when new videos are posted. Want to learn more? Click the show more link below the video to find additional resources and links. YouTube does a pretty good job of hiding it. It's right down there. See this part of the description here, right? The name, the video's up here. There's a little show more down there, right down the bottom. It's kind of hard to find. But once you click on that, you'll see a list of other videos, additional information related to the current topic, free lessons, and lots more. And YouTube no longer sends out email notifications when new videos are posted like they used to do. But if you'd like to get an email every time I post a new video, click on the link to join my mailing list. And you can pick how frequently to get emails from me, either as they happen daily, weekly, or monthly. Now, if you'd like to become a paid member of my channel and receive all kinds of awesome perks, click on the join button. You'll see a list of all the different membership levels that are available, each with its own special perks, including my extended cut videos, access to my code vault, lots of VBA source code in there, template downloads, and lots more. I'll talk more about these perks at the end of the video. Even if you don't want to commit to becoming a paid member and you'd like to help support my work, please feel free to click on the tip jar link. Your patronage is greatly appreciated and will help keep these free videos coming. I got some puppies to feed. But don't worry, no matter what, these free tech help videos are going to keep coming as long as you keep watching them I'll keep making more and they'll always be free. Now, if you really want to learn access and you haven't tried my free access level one course, check it out now. It covers all the basics of Microsoft Access, including building forms, queries, reports, and more. It's over four hours long. You can find it on my website or on my YouTube channel. I'll put a link down below you can click on. And did I mention it's completely free? The whole thing free four hours go watch it and okay okay a lot of you have told me that you don't have time to sit through a four-hour course so i do now have a quicker microsoft access for beginners video that covers all the basics faster 
in about 30 minutes. And no, I didn't just put the video on fast forward, <laughs> but I'll put a link to this down below as well. Now, if you like level one, level two is just a dollar. That's it, $1. And that's another whole like 90 minute course. Level two is also free for paid members of any level, including supporters. So if you're a member, go watch level two, it's free. Okay, want to get your question answered in a video just like this one? Visit my tech help page and send me your question there. Members get priority, of course. While I do try to read and respond to all of the comments posted below in the comments section, I only have time to go through them briefly a couple of times a month, and sometimes I get thousands of them. So send me your question here on the tech help page, and you'll have a better chance of getting it answered. And while you're on my website, be sure to stop by my Access Forum. We've got lots of lively conversations about Microsoft Access and other topics. I have a fantastic group of moderators who help me answer questions. Shout out to Alex, Kevin, Scott, Adam, John, Dan, Juan, and everybody else who helps out on the site. I appreciate everything you do. I couldn't do it without you. Be sure to follow my blog, find me on Twitter, and of course on YouTube. Yeah, I'm on Facebook too, but I don't like Facebook. Don't get me started. Now, let's talk more about those member perks if you do decide to join as a paid member. There are different levels, silver, gold, platinum, and diamond. Silver members and up get access to all of my extended cut tech help videos, one free beginner class every month, and some other perks. Gold members, get all the previous perks, plus access to download the sample databases that I build in my tech help videos, plus access to my code vault where I keep tons of different functions that I use, the code that I build in most of the videos. You'll also get higher priority if you do submit any tech help questions. Now answers are never guaranteed, but you do go higher in the list for me to read them. And if I like your question, you got a good chance of it being answered. You'll also get one free expert level class each month after you've finished the beginner series. Platinum members get all the previous perks plus even higher priority for tech help questions. You get access to all of my full beginner level courses for every subject. And I cover lots of different subjects like Word, Excel, VBA, ASP, lots of different stuff, not just access. These are the full length courses found on my website. You get all the beginner ones. In addition, once you finish the expert classes, you get one free developer class per month. So lots of training. And finally, you can also become a diamond sponsor. You'll have your name or your company name listed on a sponsors page that will be shown on each video as long as you're a sponsor. You'll get a shout out in the video and a link to your website or product in the text below the video and on my website. So that's it. Once again, my name is Richard Rost. Thank you for watching this video brought to you by AccessLearningZone.com. I hope you enjoyed. I hope you learned something today. Live long and prosper, my friends. I'll see you again soon.